up, y'all? I said, what's up, y'all? Look at me when I'm talking to you, bro. Nah, I'm just messing with you, man. This is Knockout Boxing 86 TV, and we in here. So check this out, bro. Before I get going on today's video, y'all know what to do, bro. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share the video, man. If you come through and view my video, be sure to hit that like button, bro. Put your seatbelt on when you hop in my car. And subscribe to the channel if you're new here. And share the video. And also, please remember to comment down below. I want to chop it up with y'all and talk boxing with you. But I can't do it unless you leave a comment. So be sure to comment down below, bro. And if you want to have me hop on a panel, collaborate with me. Or if there's a certain subscriber request video that you'd like me to do. You can reach out to me for those reasons at knockoutboxing86 at yahoo.com, bro. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. And today we're bringing y'all another fight prediction, man. It's right. It's a fight prediction. I told y'all we're doing six. We're doing six this week. This is our second of the week, bro. We just did the standing on this fight um, versus, um, who was he fighting? Delorme. We predict standing on us to win by knockout. And right now, we're about to do the F.A. Ajagba versus Brian Howard fight, bro. Let's get into it. F.A. Ajagba got the Olympic pedigree, right? He coming in 14-0 with 11 knockouts. Strong-ass heavyweight, bro. You know, 6'6", six, six, solid muscle. Um good good skills coming from that amateur background and making it to the olympics you know good jab that right hand behind that jab is <laughs> put you to sleep put your ass to sleep bro and he got some other good skills you know a good left hook to the body um good good one two three you know i don't want to break him down all the way he's basic in my opinion um, in terms of like facing elite elite fighters, but there aren't any elite 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 fighters at the heavyweight division You know what I mean? This is not, you know, Evander Holyfield, Lennox Lewis um, You know, Muhammad Ali's and, and Sonny Liston's and Joe Frey. It's not it's not it's not the heavyweights of that time, bro But F.A. Ajagba is very 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 strong and a very very good up-and-coming heavyweight, bro He just is he just is and so He's in action this weekend on an action-packed card, um, and he was going against Brian Howard, who is a veteran. You know, he's coming in with a 15-3 and record, I believe. Um, no, 15-4. and And he's been knocked out three of those four times. And so um, this is a setup, bro. It's an absolute setup, right? It's a setup, bro. Let's talk about Brian Howard's path to victory first, bro. He ain't got no goddamn path, all right? I ain't even going to play with y'all. He ain't got no path to victory, bro. F.A. Ajagba should be such a huge favorite in this fight, bro. He should be such a huge favorite in this fight. This is how bad the matchmaking is on this one. He should be such a huge favorite in this fight. You shouldn't even be able to get odds on this shit, bro. If you can find somebody that will give you odds on this fight, you take whatever money you got left. Damn a paycheck. I usually tell y'all to take your paycheck. Don't just take your paycheck, bro. You take your paycheck, all right? You take out a second mortgage on your house. You feel what I'm saying? You you sell your car, right? You 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 pawn shit. You do whatever you can to get as much cash on hand as possible, bro. And you put all that shit on FA Jogba in this one, bro. But I don't even think you'll be able to find no odds, bro. I don't. But it's like, well, knockout, why are you even picking a fight if it's such a far-fetched fight? Because most fights are fucking far-fetched these days, people. And I pick the hard ones, too. But I want to have fun, and it's my channel, so I pick the fights I want to pick. And that's just what it is, bro. But anyway, F.A. Jaipo by knockout, bro. Brian Howard ain't winning this, bro. He's old as hell. He's 40 years old, bro. He's 40 years old. F.A. Jaipo's about to commit murder in the ring, bro. He's 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 forty years old. Brian Howard is, and he got knocked out by dude Harvey Randall or some his name was knocked out. Everybody getting knocked out, bro. The dude that knocked him out was like twelve and nineteen, bro. He got knocked out by that dude. And he about to get in the ring with Fa, bro. For all the flaws I think Fa got, he putting Buddy to sleep, bro. This dude ain't gonna be the one to expose, right? This is a resume builder. This is the one to just add a W to the column, bro. They got it scheduled for 10 rounds. It ain't going half of that shit. And we about five minutes in, so the video about to be over. 
It's about to be over because that she it. She it. Don't get up and go to the bathroom during this fight, y'all. Don't get up and go to the bathroom. Don't go get you a drink. Don't do none of that shit. F.A. is going to put this dude to sleep, bro. So there you have it. F.A. a jockey by knockout over Brian Howard. We ain't getting into Brian Howard's skills. Because it don't matter what he got. He's going to sleep at 40 years old, bro. Shouldn't even be in there with F.A., man. But they putting him in there and he about to get his ass knocked out. Smoothed out. Not no stoppage, right? Not no TKO shit. Not no, not no corner, corner throwing in the towel. He's getting put to sleep, bro. And so y'all know what it is. We about six minutes in. Short ass video. Because it's going to be a short ass fight, bro. This fight is not going the distance. It's not even going five rounds, bro. It's just not. F.A. is too good in everything, bro. His water is better, right? His mouth guard is better. His uniform that he going to wear is probably going to be better. He better offensively, defensively, athleticism, amateur pedigree. He's just better than Brian Howard, bro. There's a reason Brian Howard is 40 years old and only got 19 fights, bro. He ain't no full-time fighter like that. Put him in the ring with F.A. to get his ass put to sleep, man. It's messed up, bro. Y'all wrong for that shit. But anyway, bro, y'all let me know what y'all think. If you pick anybody other than F.A. or Jogba in this fight right here, if you pick the other dude, bro, unsubscribe from me. Unsubscribe from me because I don't need, I don't want nobody that's doing crazy shit like that. You know, yes, I do, bro. Yes, I do. You know what I'm saying? I'm bullshitting. You're welcome. If you still want to pick the other dude in my con, go ahead, bro. Pick him. Pick them, but but shit, don't put no money on it because F.A. about to put Buddy to sleep, man. Anyway, let me know what y'all think, man. Comment down below. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video. You know what I mean? Put your seatbelt on when you hop in my car. You came through and watch it, so go ahead and hit the like button, bro. You feel what I'm saying? And also, if you want to have me hop on the panel or collaborate with me, knockoutboxing86 at yahoo.com is the email. Again, it's Knockout Boxing, the number 8, the number 6 at yahoo.com. I appreciate y'all watching. Everybody enjoy the rest of your day. And with that, we out here. Peace.